Hello everybody, welcome to Sunday Showcase. I'm your host, Wizworld 100 and the votes are in and the game that, or system, I keep screwing this up every time, but the system that uh, I'm going to be playing on is the PC slash uh, Steam platform. Uh, thanks for all that uh, tried voting, there was a kind of a tie before where it was like four dis different systems, but um, yeah, eventually it broke and it was the uh, PC and Steam platform, so let's get on to playing it. The game that I'm going to be playing is a game that I got recently from Humble Bundle, and that is um, this bundle that contained Shantae Risky's Revenge, the director's cut. So, uh, I can't wait to play. Oh, it was the uh, Awesome Games Done Quick 2015 uh, that was going on. That was why the bundle existed. So, uh, let's get on to playing Shantae Risky's Revenge. Alright, so now... Oh yeah, the game was made by Way Forward. Press any key to play. I have played a little bit of it and well there we go. Ah uh, hmm. I don't want to restart the game. Cause it really there's no point there's no point. So we're gonna start from where I was playing. So there's Shantae. Uh, I have never played a Shantae game. Uh, I haven't really heard about it. But uh it's from but what from what I have heard is that the quality is pretty good. Oh, whoops, that's the magic button. Yeah, I, di I just kind of specifically didn't play it so so uh, that I can show it on Sunday Showcase. Who's out there? The lunch courier? You don't have my tasty meal get lost. Hey, at least the gate isn't fat. Oh, yeah, this. That's how I move around the level. Because it's much faster to slide, almost. Oh, it's spiders! Harem! Harem? <laughs> and I thought those were Medusas, but, uh... Clearly, that wasn't the case. Okay, jumping there goes back up. Yeah, so you have an inventory where you select your magic. That's the magic that I selected. We also have this map over here. And I'm in that little... That little uh, spot that's blinking right now. If it wasn't obvious. Oh, what was it that I have? Yeah, it's a dog. It's a puppy. It's, it's, cuteness, it's cuteness makes your heart sing. I think I'm supposed to return it to like someone, and like I said, I, I didn't play it that much because I wanted to do it for Sunday Showcase. I thought this was a pretty good game to do for Sunday Showcase, and uh, yeah, I expect it to be a good showcase. Oh, so far, I can definitely say this, I definitely really, 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 really like the pixel artwork. Like, it, it's not a lost art, but you know, it's definitely very cool, and I love seeing games that, uh, I love seeing pixel art. It's just, it's just great. Because all the work and effort you put into it, like, mm, 3D games still have their place, but I, I definitely love, love the pixels for their imagination. Sorry, miss, I'm very sorry, but today's orders are all backed up. It sounded... could have gone weird. My dream has always been to become a master chef, chef traveling the world to rule with my pup Wobble Bell, but he seems to have run away, and without him to inspire my dream dish, my miss my pup so much. Ah, uh, the, the text box is kind of a little weird. It's... It's kind of like out of place. How do I? S can I? Can I show the? Can it be? Is that my wobble bell? Please, can I have my precious pup back? Yes. Gave the puppy. Oh, at least I found out where the dog was supposed to be. Who let the dogs out? You're back. Seeing you again fills me with vigor. Wrong button. I have not played this with a controller, which might have, which might actually be a lot better. Oh, Miss, how can I ever thank you? I know. We'll celebrate by tr trying out my latest recipe. Stand back and watch me sizzle. You're gonna burn? You don't need me to shoot the fireballs, do you? What's she adding? Is that like just more water or more milk? What are you doing? Voila! That's how we cook up, cook up a tasty meal using only natural ingredients. I'll tell you this, her food is definitely not fat. You got a tasty meal. Mmm. Way forward knows how to use their words, right? Definitely not fattening or fretting at all. Especially if you know what I know uh, how I go about. Is that all that is uh, going here? That was literally it. Kind of feels like uh, some of these spots are there just for that one point, and that it's like kind of like you just have this like a bunch of obstacles like in your way, just so that we only need to go there once, or presumably once. I don't I haven't played the game enough to get my final thoughts on it, but it has that. It, it makes me think of the Castlevania uh, games, the the S Metroidvania type, and that's a good good uh, format for this game. Although so far it just kind of seems like uh, there are places I would, don't need to go back to. All right, what is this heavenly smell? 
Great snap, is that tasty meal? Hurry up and bring it inside. I believe this is the dungeon that we're gonna be in. Hello, octopus. <laughs> Look at his face. You're the delivery boy. Um, yes, boy. Yeah. It's about time you got here. I put my orders in hours ago. I'm famish. I'm not a boy. Okay then. Dine and ditch. Hey, open the door. Hopefully there's not another locked one. That guy is so dead. Ooh. Did that give me more hearts or oh damn it. How do I get down there? Kind of a hairy way to a to attack, but wait, what the Oh no, that was just my hair going or her hair going through it, not my hair. My hair is not that long. And I'm not the type to actually grow my hair long enough because it gets very, very irritating. Wait, maybe no. Can't I jump down? <laughs> She's wiggling her butt. There, a little dance, which uh, pauses the game. I don't know what it does, what what purpose it has yet. Yeah, but basically, uh, pixel art. Like someone had to put in that effort to make a wiggly butt. Got to approve that. Oh, you know it's a bottomless pit of death because there's death everywhere. Come on, dot. Oh, you need to time your hit just right. It's one of those things. That's not too bad. The enemy's uh, AI isn't that um, aggressive. Wait, could I have hit that that other block in that other uh, room? We'll have to find out later. Find out when we return after these messages. Ooh, that's a lot of gems. Yeah, you buy your spells and you upgrade your spells by buying them. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, I didn't mean to hit that. I don't even know, I don't even know how I hit that. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, is there something up there? Or is it like a shortcut that I can go back to? Well, that's not ominous at all. Oh, I just can do the typical uh, jump up and grab the rope quickly. Oh. Can't I get down there? Butt wiggle. Whoa, it kind of reminds me of uh, in the, the jungle book with uh, Mowgli and the shooting plant. Burn into the fire in inferno. Oh, I got a I got a achievement for the unexpected. Son of a bitch, I should have known. I knew there had to be a way to get down here somehow. No! Ah, oldest trick of the book. Sneaking past me like that. Hang on. A quick edit will get me back there. Alright, now that we're back here, let's try not to lose it. There we go, didn't lose it that time. Anyways, also, uh, what was it? The pirate curse is all is uh, already out. So, I was trying to get that, but uh, apparently our... our Canadian prices are much more than the American prices. So it was like, it was one of those like, what the, f what the fuck? I even went out of my way to go like to buy a, um, an e card for it. Wait a minute. Oh, I see. I have to hit him in the head. Yeah, I was trying to buy the Pirates Curse, but it ended up being like twenty five dollars, and I was like, and I was like, oh come on. So then I ended up buying Dark Siders instead because I uh, wanted the coins to get the platinum. And uh, what do you know? Let's see, Dark Sider two. Gave me quite a lot of coins. Would you like to save? Yes. Now, pardon me if I don't talk. Hey, this isn't that one room where. Oh, I was gonna say this kind of reminds me of that one room in Castlevania, where it's like you fight Legion, and you gotta like run across the room. I'm not gonna make it like a little face now, am I? Uh oh, it looks like a Death Skull. It's a trap. Oh, cut! You, you're serious? I couldn't grab it until it dropped to the ground. No, no beautiful rupee you are mine, yes, but wiggle. Ah, treasure. Oh, good thing I decided to turn back, because I was like, I was like, if you can get back up, then there's no real reason for you to, uh, there's no reason that there's two ways to get back up. Burn in the fires of the inferno. Inferno. You guys ever played a, whatchamacallit, a killer instinct? Inferno. Hmm. Oh, hey, look at the statues. Pretty neat. <laughs> Get it? Pretty and neat. Alright, what's this? Who approached my magic fountain? <laughs> I sense a restless energy deep inside you. Oh, is that my little sister? Channel your passion and allow the magic to take shape. Oh, I don't have to press the dance button? You've got the monkey dance. Oh, but it involves dancing. Simply hold the button and then release it during your first belly dance moment with the transform. The monkey dance will allow you to climb walls and leap to new heights. Change back. Press the dance button. May fortune follow you in your travels. That's kinda cool. 
bitch. <laughs> Look at that monkey. Release the dance bus bussin button during pose one. Oh, there we go. That that took a little while to work. <laughs> She's a funny little monkey. Mm, all these sexy statues standing in the back and their waist are unbelievably thin. So you managed to solve my labyrinth. Well, yeah, but it's not that difficult being the first one. But it won't do you any good. My magic steel seal is staying right here. Me and my babies are ready to tussle. Ow. There are too many octopus. Even in a way forward game, there has to be tentacle. I knew what to do to avoid that, I just didn't do it right. Oh crap, I'm about to die. Oh, oh, heart! Aw, oh, come on. Hmm, you have a lot of health, don't you? Ah, oh, is he just recovering from all that? Okay, yes, I beat him. I'm gonna poop in your pan! Oh, you oh, can't even, like, can't, like, taunt Dan, because I'm just gonna wiggle my butt in front of it. Oh, where, what is that, where is that from? I remember something like, a similar spinning around in glory kind of thing. I can't see. Get the fuck off my screen, Mr. Crow. Select, or, space bar. Oh no, risky. Risky boots. Man, that boss fight went on a lot longer than I thought. I didn't expect it to be short, but that did take a while. I almost died was how sad it was. I mean, honestly, that boss fight wasn't very hard. I was just, I was just a, I was just a derp. So, that was uh, Shantae, Risky's Revenge on PC, the director's cut. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, watching it. I hope Way, way Forward uh, checks this out uh, and seeing how terrible I play and commentate over this game. But uh, it's, it's a pretty neat game. I'll need to play it some more. But so far, it's shown uh, real good potential and such. And, well, yeah. Uh, I hope you guys will also go to my site, LazyWorksCreations.com, go to the Sunday Showcase poll to vote for the next Sunday Showcase so we get to see more games being showcased such as this. So, uh, yeah. This is Wizworld 100, you're the viewers, and I'm the showcaser. So, see ya!